Okay, so me and Evelyn are about to go to the Meerkat Cafe. It is a really ugly day, but it's fun. We're about to see some cute animals. Sure, I guess <laughs> we'll just cut to some footage of us actually there because <laughs> the um, walk there isn't very exciting because it's ugly and raining. <laughs> so yeah, um, Meerkat Friends is the place we went to. It's in Hongdae and when we got there we paid the entrance fee which is like 12,000 won and we took off our shoes and put on some slippers and then we just kind of like went and looked at all the animals. And so after a bit of playing and like playing with some of the animals that weren't meerkats, we sat down and we, all you had to do was you got in kind of in line to get to be with the meerkats. There's rules like you can't have anything in your pockets, you have to take off all your jewelry because the meerkats will like they try to steal them. <laughs> And they like to dig, so they give you a blanket to put over your laps. And it was just an awesome time. For some reason, all the meerkats loved me. At one point, all of the meerkats in the enclosure, except for two, were sleeping on my lap. It was a great time. I felt like I had adopted, like, 13 children. <laughs> so I accidentally adopted a bunch of children. What I, I especially liked at this cafe is that the staff really did their best to let the customer have the best experience without jeopardizing the animal's happiness. Like the staff would kind of like encourage the animals to come and interact with the customers, but they wouldn't force them to, which I think is really important. Or, and the animals, like if they really, really did not want to be bothered, they definitely had a place that they were able to go and get away from humans and just kind of have their own time, which I think is very, very important for the well-being and healthy mentality of the animals. And so I think that this cafe did that really well. Do you? 